Alright, so in my last video, I um, did uh, the top part here. Now in this video, I'm going to do this, 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 and this. So, this, 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 this. Now, they're all a bunch of jiggity jiggity lines. Now, for the most part, I used these, these uh, pens. For the most part, in the first video, I used these ones. Now, in the same packet come these. So, this is what I'm going to be using for this layer. So I'm going to do this triangle here, I'm going to do this triangle here, and then um, off camera, and then once I finish that, I'll show you what it looks like, then I'll do this triangle off camera, and then show you, then I'll do this uh, triangle off camera and show you, and then I'll do this one off camera and show you. So. I know the quality of this uh, lighting and all this stuff isn't the greatest, but, well, you work with what you got. So, at least you can see me, so it's not that dark. Uh, yeah, so. Alright, I'll get back to you when I finish the first triangle. Okay, so here's what it looks like right now. I just uh, wanted to record so that my screen doesn't end up timing out on me before I finish. So... That's what it looks like right now. As soon as I finish it, um, I will have a clearer image of it. But yeah, um, so. Okay, so this is my current triangle. At first I'd gone in and kind of blended them like I blended over here, but then I didn't really like that, so I just changed it. Now, the way I decided the pattern choices for the different triangles was because they were in that package and beside each other. So I put them together to see if they would be good together. Now some of them were good together, some of them were not. Definitely not good together. Um, but yeah, this is what it looks like so far. And uh, I'll get back to you when I finish the second triangle. Also, another thing, I have my fan going, so if that affects the audio, so be it. I'm hot, so I'm having my fan going. And that's why the case behind me is moving, because the fan is kind of facing on it. Just so you know, in case you can hear that and, are bu and it bugs you why you can't figure out what that is. Um, but yeah, as I said before, I will get back to you when I finish the next triangle. Or I might pause in between so that... I don't have to worry about my screen fading out, um, but yeah, then uh, I probably will pause at the middle of doing it so my screen doesn't fade out, and then uh, I'll get back to you then. Okay, so I have done the first half of the uh, triangle. Now I'm just showing you this so my screen doesn't time out on me while I finish it. So. When I finish this, I will put my uh, I will put my phone's flashlight underneath it so you can see it better. But for right now, this is what it looks like. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna finish this and then show you what it looks like with my phone's flashlight underneath it. So this is the finished product of this side. Now, the reason why I have this board in here is because pens kind of leave like an indent on the piece of paper underneath them. And because this is a book, so it has other pages in it, I don't want it to indent my new page. Um, so that's why this is here. As well as it's also a safety guard so I don't draw on my table. Um, but yeah, so that's this. Now I'm going to replicate that on this side. So, for this one, uh, after half, after I've done half, which will probably be right around here, I will show you just so that I don't have to worry about the screen timing out on me. 
as well as the same applies to this triangle. So, I will do those triangles. I will do this half of this triangle off screen, show you, and then do the other half. So, okay, so this is what the half looks like right now and everything. So, I know that you can't really see it that well right now, um, but when I finish, like I've done with the other ones, you will see it with light. Um, fun fact, I'm one of those people who if, um, one of my art projects or whatever, like, craft supplies, uh, come in a kit with a box or, like, these gel pens, they don't come, and don't come with a carrying case for them, I actually will keep them in their casing that, uh, I bought them in. Um, I also have this thing where when I have, like, pencils or markers in a case, all the lids have to be facing the same way. Box the heck out of me when they're not. Um, but, uh, yeah. So, yeah, that's what that, what it looks like right now. I will get back to you when I finish, um, the rest of this triangle. Okay, so I just completed this triangle right here. Um, now I'm going to replicate this triangle over here. Okay? So I'll do that off camera because I don't have two camera angles and editing sites and everything. So I basically get one take to get this right. So. This is why I'm going to do this part um, off camera. I'm going to do half of it so my screen doesn't time out, and then do the other half. Good. Okay, so I finished half of this triangle here, and now I have to finish the ha other half. So once I finish the other half, like I've been doing before, you will see my. Uh, the light from my phone so that it'll be more clear on what the colors are. So. Now I finished this triangle here. It's all done. And this has been part two of a six part series of videos. Um, basically by the end of the six videos you will see this image all finished. Now this image, now this challenge I'm kind of making up, it's called the gel pill, pen challenge. So you have to illustrate something or color something in using only gel pens. You can only use gel pens in this challenge. So it's called the gel pen challenge. So I hope you enjoyed watching me do this part of the um, piece. And, uh, you know, watch next week to see me do this piece here. These, these little bumpy waves here. Now these waves, these ones here. So, which they actually look like, uh, seat cushions when you, are uh, chairs at a theater. So, these. <laughs> so, wait till next video to see me do this. Or next week to see me do a video on coloring this in. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Like, subscribe, check out more of my videos. And, uh, yeah. I hope you enjoyed. Stay happy.